Do you lack confidence in yourself and feel stuck in a job that you hate or a relationship that isn't working out? Fear of failure and not being good enough takes all our confidence and it leaves us stuck and living a life that's unfulfilled. Meet Jen, who was struggling with her confidence, which left her not knowing what to do with her life, even though she felt there was so much more for her. Jen's journey has changed everything for her, including how she feels about herself, how she communicates with others, as well as improving every area of her life, including career success, relationships, and her general well-being. Now, when you first came to me, what were some of the issues and challenges that you were experiencing? I was very unsure in myself, so my confidence was lacking, definitely. Feeling pretty good now, like I'm feeling pretty confident, pretty, pretty... Trying to be more confident in my decision making. So I'm not sure how I would have went quitting the job. Um, I'm sure there was other factors as well, but I think um, definitely it helped. Yeah. Um, I definitely really... The clearings helped a lot, I think, because You don't sit there and think about that, that you just sit there and hold it all in, but where you sit there and you have that person in front of you, you can say what you you want to say, Um, even though they're not there, it's taking it out of you. It's not your problem anymore. You've put it out in the universe. It's not not in you anymore. Yeah, exactly. That's why I call them clearings. Yeah, (laughs) clearing it out. Yes, getting it out. Yeah, Yeah, clearing out the closet. I I definitely think that's helped a bit. And it's probably made me think or try and think a little bit more or yeah made me more aware and think about things that are happening not just go with the flow so be like oh why is that happening what's yeah yeah beautiful. why am I doing this yeah yeah so you've learned more about yourself I think so yeah 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 beautiful and because you're all the way over in Perth not right now you're in Brisbane <laughs> <laughs> how did you find the online process yeah I think it was all right I think it was fine Obviously, um, maybe it made it easier. You don't have to stress about going somewhere and then trying to get home afterwards. Yeah. And then how are you with the recordings that I sent you? Yeah, I enjoy I do like recordings, yeah. Yeah, yeah, fantastic. All right, so then tell me, what does the future look like now? It's, it's look, I think it's good. I'm positive about it. I don't know what it's going to be, but I'm trying not to be like, <gasps> what is it going to be? What am I doing with my life? It's just... I'm like, okay, I'd like to have a good plan, but I'm like, I don't need one. Um, I tend to be fine. So why am I stressing about it? Like I've never gone somewhere I hated it and then been miserable and depressed for months on end, if you know what I mean. Like, so why do I think that's going to happen? If Even if I don't know anyone, I tend to make friends pretty easily and find something that I can do by myself and find enjoyment in everyday life, if you know what I mean. Absolutely. What does that say I don't to you? S- yeah. Uh, I guess I'm resilient. I just need to not be in my head and be like, I can't do that. I can't do this. Yeah. And as you said, your confidence. Yeah. Because your confidence has grown. Yeah. Yes, definitely. Yeah. And I'm more willing to make mistakes instead of being afraid of what the mistake's going to be. That's a lot of power in that. Yeah. Yeah, because that fear of failure stops us so much. Oh, yes, definitely. And it's horrible because then you just get stay, like stuck in a spot. And Yeah. Did you think this coaching, this journey was worth it? Uh, yeah, I, I think it's helped a lot. So your self-talk's changed? Yes, I think so. I've certainly seen, you know, y- your confidence grow. You seem to be more sure of yourself. You know, yeah. A lot more at ease with your feelings. Yeah, right. And I think so. All I hope is that I've given you some tools, cleared some of the stuff that need to be cleared and allow the subconscious to create new beliefs. Yeah, it's, it seems to be, but yeah, Thank awesome. You. Thank you very much. For, you know, this, this beautiful journey and, and, and good luck with the new job. Thank you, yes. Thanks, Jen. <laughs> All, All right, right, bye. Bye. Do you feel like there's something holding you back in life? Fear of failure, lack of confidence, low self-esteem. If these are obstacles that are keeping you from moving forward with your goals, it can be hard to break through these barriers on your own. 
Book a call with me and together we can overcome these fears, build your confidence, your self-esteem and change your self-belief so that you can be empowered to move forward towards what really matters most to you and love your life.